Good morning, guys. How are we doing? I hope you're good. Welcome to the Morning JB Show. I'm your host, James Borman. I'm chilling in the camping chair. Monday morning, beautiful uh, sea behind me. And today we're going to be talking about character building. Um, now, if you are coming through, do let me know. Like, comment, share. Tell me where you're at. It'd be good to know that you're coming through. So, the first introduction for character building for me was um, in 2003 when I joined the Royal Marines. We get put into this foundation block. Now, this foundation block is where um, Royal Marine recruits go into um, for their first two weeks. It's like a cattle market, really, to get rid of the guys who really are not strong enough to be there. And they put us through our paces. And I don't forget the first speech of the collar sergeant that walked in. He's a big, burly guy coming down here. Not the type of guy you uh, would fuck with. He gave this amazing speech. And he said, guys, your characters are going to be tested like n- never before. You're going to go through emotions you've never been through before. And you're going to be smashed into the ground and brought back up. And he wasn't wrong. 32 weeks of um, brutal training developed my character over eight months and very much forged who I am today in terms of the way that I become resilient, in the, ter- in the way that I become very robust towards life, in my attitude and approach to life. Now, I think personally, character building is one of the most important factors to anybody's health anybody's business development, anybody's relationship growth. And I think for a large amount of people that struggle, we often become quite soft-minded. And this is how, uh, when situations become very difficult, we don't really harden up. And sometimes, if something's hard, we have to match it by being hard. And I don't mean that as in hard down the pub. But I mean as in being resilient, as in being robust, as in not letting the small things knock you, as in not being distracted. Okay, And character building is helping you and learning you to show you what you are capable of as a human being in terms of how you see the world, in terms of getting your exercise goals and um, aspirations in the bag and getting them complete. As in growing your business or growing your career. As in building your relationships. And so many people don't ever get to where they want to be with their relationships or their, or their fitness or their health or the way they look. Because the character hasn't built up enough. At the weekend, we had a group of guys come down for a 20-hour boot camp. And the purpose for me, for those guys to come down, is character building. It's to show them what they're capable of. Now, we did 20 hours of brutal work. So we started at 9 o'clock at night. We was up at 2 in the morning. We was up at 6 in the morning. And then we finished with like a a five-hour hill session with power bags, hills, logs, the lot. And the idea is that I want to show these guys what they are capable of because I don't think they quite realize. And before we went on to the hill, we talked about all of the things that were getting in the way of them becoming the best version of themselves the place where they want to be, moving the needle forwards. And a lot of it was self-doubt, fear, not feeling as though they're good enough for their business, for their change of direction, to, to be a partner to someone. And all of this become very overwhelming. We did the heel session and every single one of those guys went away. I know they went away emotional. Because we broke them down, broke them down to, to, their, to their core layer, broke down all of the faces that they wear, all of the masks that they wear, all of the bullshit that they, that they convinced themselves that they're not good enough and that this, to, to be where they want to be. <clears throat> and we broke them down right down to the bare bones so that they could find out what they were made of. And it's not just to go beast them, it's to show them that they are good enough. It's to show that, that they can achieve whatever they want to do. That they, that they have the persistence and the resilience and the robustness and the hardness and the character to lose weight, to change their business, to be a great partner. And character building is establishing and open up the brainwaves and the mindset 
so that you actually realize that you can do it. How many times do you say, oh, I can't do this, I can't do that, I can't do this, but then you do it. When I gave them their log, which took all four of them to carry, we, we, we run or we moved for, four, uh, for two miles, non-stop, not putting the log down. And they were all going, we can't do it, can't do it. And they did it. And you can see the elation in their face. You can see the shock. They're like, oh my God, I did this. And if we were able to adapt that higher level of character in each individual one of us, imagine what you could achieve in your, in your health goals, in your nutrition goals, in your business, in your career, in your relationships. You'd be unstoppable. You'd be unbreakable. And that's why the importance of character building is so, so important. So my challenge to you is how are you challenging your character? How are you testing yourself how are you testing your limits? Are you, are you doing your workouts in the morning? Are you doing as much as you can in your career to push yourself and get your time management right? Are you building your business as, as aggressively as you could? Are you attentive to your relationships, your children, your partners? Or is life owning you rather than you owning life? And the character building is a big part of that. Next year, you're going to look out for the big project. And the big project is going to be a whole weekend of character building with me. And it's going to be amazing. And it's going to test you to your limits. And you're going to go away a completely different guy, believing in himself with confidence, drive, ambition to be the best version of yourself. But you can do that every day, but with little tests by showing up and doing your workout when you don't feel like it. Like coming home with some flowers and telling your wife you love her rather than being stressy and everyone else treading on eggshells around you. You can do that by going the extra mile to develop your career and your business. You can do that by managing your time and being home in time for dinner, being disciplined. Those small little tests of your character will build up over time. Guys, thank you for watching. Really appreciate it. If you do come through, remember to like, comment and share. And you can grab my audio book if you haven't. Links on the page. It's on Amazon. It gets released on November the 12th, something like that. But I hope you have a great Monday and I'll catch you soon.